Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Ocean back with another Destiny 2 Daily Legend Lost Sector video and before we get over to the moon to do this one, uh, I know I get a lot of comments about the video quality ha having like kind of like a, a wash over it. It's like bright a little bit. Uh, I thought it was my Destiny 2 game itself or even my monitor or whatever. I don't know why it'd be my monitor, um, but it looks good on my screen, but every time I render it, it comes out weird. So I... I kind of dissected it I believe it was my editing software so hopefully I fixed it or at least made it better while I continue to look into it and uh, mess with some things but I do believe it should be better this time around let me know what you guys think and uh, well here we go we're heading over to the moon we are doing the K01 logistics champions are barrier and overload the burn is void shields are arc and solar modifier hot knife and we are going for some exotic chest armor today Weapons that we are going to be using, we're going with the Linear Fusion Rifle Loadout. The Arbalest is going to take care of our Arc Shields as well as our Barrier Champions if we do uh, not kill them before they shield up. We are using the Typon 4FR Linear Fusion Rifle. I haven't used this one too much. I'm only level 11, <clears throat> so I don't have all of the best perks on it, but this is the uh, crafted version that you can get God Rule. So this is a very good weapon to use. And then we are going to use the Under Your Skin Combat Bow. This is going to be for our Overload Champions as well as is Void, so it's just going to deal some pretty good damage. Uh, we will be using our Throbing Knives quite a bit in this one. Uh, good for the Solar Shanks that do come out, and then I believe there is a Arc... Um, there is an Arc sh uh, Shield of Knight or Captain in the first room, but we don't actually have to kill it. Uh, anyways, we are going to be using the Linear Fusion Rifle Ammo Finder, as well as one hands-on. Make sure you have your Overload Bow perk on. If you're using the Arbalest, you do not need Barrier perk on. And uh, other than that, guys, we are using the Solar Subclass of so my Hunters. We are using Gambler's Dodge, Triple Jump, Knife Trick, Healing Grenade with Knock Them Down on your mark. Ember of Beams, Singeing, Solace, Torches, and Char. Alright guys, let's hop in there, run through it, and see what this one is all about.
Alright guys, there we go. 2 minutes and 49 seconds, and that was actually a really good run. This one just does take a little bit of time. We gotta kill everything in the second room. We gotta kill a lot of things in that last room, just so we can get the, uh, the boss to take his shield down. Uh, so there it goes. That's uh, a pretty good run, 2 minutes 49 seconds. If you can get anywhere in between 2 to 3 minutes, I think you're doing good. Even a little over 3 is probably still solid for this lost sector. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed the rest of your day. Have fun with the Destiny 2 Halloween event. It's pretty cool. I do like those haunted lost sectors. I do enjoy playing those ones. But uh, that's it for now guys. Thank you again for watching. I'll catch you guys all later on my next video. And have a good one. Oh, <laughs> yeah.